All right, we're taking a look at some uh, some suppressed pistols here. This time we're going to take a look at the Walther P22. And this one's sporting a Hunter Town Arms suppressor right now. So first off, we've got magazine releases underneath both sides of the trigger guard, which is kind of handy. We do have a slide lock on it. It also has a magazine safety, so the trigger's dead and the magazine's removed. and the uh, safety is on the slide with no decocker, which is a little different than the Ruger that came after it. This one is in a tan color, does have an accessory rail, and very lightweight. It doesn't have the removable grip like the Ruger, but it does have a removable back strap uh, that's rubberized, has a very ergonomic, nice feel. There's just a little bit of texture in the grip, makes it easy to hold on to. These are actually pretty pleasant to shoot, even though they're a little small for most hands, because there's no recoil, it's really not uncomfortable to shoot it at all. The sights are nice, they're a three dot sort of set that'll go over the top of most 22 suppressors. Pretty nice little gun, this one has a longer, kind of a thicker suppressor on it, and it has kind of a neat overall shape. Of course, you can imagine it with the smaller Gem Tech as well. Nice little pistol for the money. Hope you enjoyed this little series. Thanks for watching. The guys and gals at GunWebsites.com encourage you to take a CCW class every year, practice at least once a month, and carry every day. Thanks for watching GunWebsites.